Adult scoliosis has been subjected to a lot of scientific research. These binders are filled with all the science that supports scoliosis research. I have collected all this over years, and I use this as a reference so that I can see, and I also like to discuss this with the patients. Sometimes I'll get a medical doctor as a patient, or somebody has more of a scientific background. I let them look through this. Let them satisfy themselves as to what the research says. But I want to summarize it to you in a few minutes. Adult scoliosis is very treatable, but we have to qualify how do we define success in the adult. For example, are we gonna take an adult and make the same changes that we're gonna make in a 10 or 11 year old child? No, but the adults I find are very realistic about their expectation. They understand that, they're not looking for that. What they're looking for is pain control, number one. And yes, we're very effective at getting the adults out of pain. Number two, we wanna stop the progression of the curve. Yes, we're very effective to do that. Number three, we wanna help them cosmetically. Even an older person has their vanity and they don't like the way it looks that one waist is sticking out more than the other or one shoulder is tilted and we're able to very effectively improve the cosmetics. And you're gonna see some images that I'm gonna to attach to this video that's gonna show before and after uh, images of postural change that we can achieve in the adult. And the last thing is correction. How much correction can we get? A modest amount of correction is very realistic. And what would I say is a modest amount? 15 to 20% reduction in the curve is very typical. We see this almost all the time. So most adults are very appreciative to get that kind of result. They have had no possible opportunity for treatment other than pain control most of the time when they arrive here and they're sick of it. They feel like, why am I just killing the pain? What about the problem? And every time they go back to get another x-ray, little worse, little worse, little worse. Here we have the opportunity to get them out of pain naturally. No drugs are involved. Here we have the opportunity to help them cosmetically. They love that. Here we have the opportunity to at least dramatically slow down the progression. In many cases, stop it. Since I began treatment with Dr. Strauss, one of my biggest successes has been my ability to stand for longer periods of time. But prior to treatment, I could only stand for about 20 minutes before my back hurt. And I recently went on a trip and went to a concert and I was able to stand for four hours without pain or discomfort. And I feel really good about that. When I first started treatment, my curve was in the 40 degree range. And after treatment, it was 36 degrees. And six months later, when I returned for my follow-up treatment, I was at 37 degrees, which is really good for adults um, because my main goal is to maintain um, the progress that I've made and um, not to necessarily get rid of my scoliosis, but mostly to be able to live with it um, without pain. So can we treat adult scoliosis? You bet, yes. Effectively, with no drugs, it's a painless treatment, and more importantly, we are empowering the patient to take care of themselves. We train you on the exercises here, we develop a customized program for you to do, but where do you do it? 99% of the treatment is done in your own home. You don't need to come back here. And if you don't live in this area, I am going to find a chiropractor or a physical therapist or somebody that can follow up with you in the area where you live. I will talk to them. I will explain to them what's going on and you will have that continuity of care. Yes, I wanna see you from time to time. I wanna make sure that everything's tracking and doing what we expected to do. But fundamentally, you're doing the treatment yourself at home. We wanna empower the patient to self-treat. These binders are full of evidence that supports conservative exercise-based treatment for adult scoliosis. Serious evolution of the scoliosis. And I came to see Dr. Strauss at the moment, at that moment, with enormous hip pain and pain shooting down my leg and pain in my lower back and um, beginning to really affect how I felt about me as well. And about, you know, my God, I turned 70, what's, is my life closing, you know, is my mobility ending? And ever since I came from the first treatment, my pain disappeared. My pain disappeared my spirits went up immediately because I didn't have that pain. I could get in and out of the car, I could get up and walk, and 
I, I could get dressed normally, put my shoes, bend down. And um, I said, wow, uh, kind of a little, very surprised, but oh my God, is this going to last? So I have been following the, all the offerings that Dr. Dr. Strauss has made. Um, I come, in the last two weeks, I didn't come every week, but I've been coming every week. The adjustments, the visits, the treatment here is, it has an incredible effect. And then I have began the exercises and I'm not like a super disciplined person. So um, there's hope even for me. There's hope even for people like me who turned 70, who have had scoliosis all their lives and did not have access to this treatment early in life. Um, my curve is very strong and um, pronounced and um, evidently uh, the goal of my treatment is to preserve the mobility that I have, to delay any further development of the curve, and to prevent other um, consequences of the scoliosis. Thanks for watching. I hope you found all this information helpful. Please subscribe if you'd like to have more information about scoliosis, and don't forget to hit the bell. That'll alert you whenever we publish new information. And if you've got any questions, write them in the comments field, and I'm gonna make sure to address them in a future video. Thanks for watching.